Good evening, Chairman Wright, Superintendent Halterman, and school board members. Two years ago, we started the process of creating an Allegheny County Public School Employee Hall of Fame. Last fall, we inducted our first class, and tonight we welcome our second. Our Hall of Fame committee this past year included former school board member Jennifer Seckner and retired employees Jan Hobbs, Becky Smith, and Valerie Humphreys. It's my privilege at this time to introduce Callahan Elementary School principal, Mr. Josh Kraft, who will present our first inductee here this evening. Mr. Kraft. Thank you, Mr. Vaughn. Give my second speech out. Mr. Chairman, Madam Superintendent, board members, I am honored and humbled to be asked to present the first member of the Allegheny County Public Schools Hall of Fame class of 2021. And I think because she's first, that makes her valedictorian. <laughs> Brenda Seibel, will you please come join me up here? I think she's a little nervous about what I'm going to say. I'm going to give a little bit of historical background on Brenda's career with Allegheny County Schools. Uh, in August of 1973, she was hired by Bill Hodges, who was the principal at Central Elementary School, as a second grade teacher. And she remained at Central for the next 25 years, teaching kindergarten, first, second, and fourth grades until her transfer to Clifton Middle School in 1995. And that's the old Clifton Middle School, former Clifton Forge High School in Clifton Forge where she served as a seventh grade teacher with the title and the responsibilities of head teacher. In 1998, Mrs. Seifel ex accepted the position of principal at Falling Spring Elementary before returning to Central School to serve as its principal for its final year of operation in 20, in 20, in 2000, 2001. I remember that very well. Indeed. With the opening of the brand new Clifton Middle School in September of 2001, Ms. Seifel was appointed to lead the new school into the dawn of the new century and continued to serve in that capacity until her retirement in June of 2016. In total, she accumulated 43 years of experience in educating countless students and teachers of the Allegheny Highlands. Now for the mushy part. If I was ever asked to name one single person who I know of who unequivocally devoted their entire heart and soul to the education of children, Brenda Seifel is that one person with no competition. No less than three generations of local children were shaped by her caring guidance and nurturing wisdom throughout her 43-year career in Allegheny County. There are probably very few of whom that she cannot recall to this day. Brenda's other unfaltering dedication was forged by her love of children, a passion for her profession, her commitment to honesty, and her perseverance to humbly serve the community. The combination of these attributes made her a compassionate advocate as well as a fierce warrior for the students and employees she served throughout her, her 43 years. From a personal perspective, Brenda has always been a fixture of influence in my, throughout my entire life having been my first grade teacher at Central Elementary, where, was she, where she was instrumental in teaching me how to read and making sure I didn't talk too much. <laughs> to this day, I remember the sense of pride after, finisher, after finishing my first book all the way through, cover to cover, with no help. And it was no room for elephants, if you remember that book. At the onset of my professional career, and it, oh, she's going to love this. At the onset of my professional career in education right out of college, I applied for a teacher assistant position at Falling Spring Elementary, where she was the principal at the time. And you know what she did? There was only two candidates, and she turned me down. <laughs> we talk about this a lot. I don't let her forget it. But after a year and a half, uh, after a year and a half, she ultimately became the only principal I ever worked for as both a teacher and an administrator right up till her retirement. The years I spent under her guidance and leadership were the most influ influential as she mentored me through those initial rough experiences as a first and a second and a third and a fourth and so on, your teacher. Uh, through the stress and commitment of earning my master's degree to saying goodbye to pursue my own administrative endeavors and three years later returning full circle to work by her side as an assistant principal and her right hand man for three years. My success is only one story of countless others for which Brenda Seifel has played a key role. 
Brenda's interest and dedication to former students still persists to this day, uh, past her departure from the profession. Uh, interestingly, uh, I'm going to relate this story to you. This past May, she sent me a text message to ask for the address of a former Clifton Middle School student whom she believes she may have done a disservice to by retaining her in the seventh grade. On the contrary, this young lady's story of success was influenced by Brenda, having graduated as salutatorian of Allegheny High School, class of 2020. And she wanted to send her a card to express how proud of her she was. I know for certain that Brenda's biggest regret of her professional life was the feeling that she retired too soon. She believes that she has still has so much energy and expertise to offer and would undoubtedly return to the profession in a heartbeat. One would be hard pressed to find a retired public educator with as many years of experience who feels the way she does. Brenda devoted 110% of herself to Allegheny County Schools and its mission for educating children for nearly half a century and without a doubt she deserves a shiny gold star for all eternity in the Employee Hall of Fame. And Thursday is her 45th birthday. <laughs> Brenda Cycle. You want me to read this? Yes, sir. Okay. Your plaque, which will be displayed in the. This goes to her? Or you can do others? Okay, this was yours. Allegheny County Public Schools Hall of Fame, Brenda H. Seipel. Allegheny County Public Schools Employee Hall of Fame, inducted September 13th, 2021. Allegheny County Public Schools, 1973 to 2016. Elementary teacher, elementary principal, and middle school principal for 43 years. Let me read that part. If I were ever to ask one, uh, if I were ever asked to name one single person that I know of who unequivocally devoted their entire heart and soul to the education of children, Brenda is that one person. She deserves a shiny gold star. I won't make a speech, but I would just like to thank the school board for recognizing people like this. And I am overwhelmed and honored to be here. Um, Josh never let me forget that I didn't hire him, but there was a better place for him, and I knew that. And he went to Clifton Middle School. He did get a job, just not at Falling Spring. But it was my honor to work with him, and I am so honored tonight to receive this award and I thank everyone so much from the bottom of my heart. Thank you.